Hi there, I'm Steph, and I'm going to show you how to find iron in your cereal. Now, when I was a kid, um, I used to be so bored at breakfast time that I would read the cereal packet. I really did. I read, read everything on the cereal packet. And something that always fascinated me was, iron is this sort of metal. Do you, so is that actually in our food? Well, let's have a little look and see if we can actually extract um, some iron from these bran flakes. Now, to do this, what you need is uh, some bran flakes, a rolling pin, a clear plastic bag, and last of all, this is the sort of specialist thing you need, I suppose, you need one of these magnets. It's a neodymium magnet. Now, it's a rare earth magnet. They're not that cheap, um, but they're really, really, really powerful and actually quite dangerous. Uh, this is a spoon and I mean, it's genuinely very hard to get off it. Now, the thing you need to do is get out some brown flakes. And let's say about half of these should do the trick. Let's save half for later. Okay, and then you need to crush them up using your rolling pin. You could do this in a food processor if you want, get really crummy. In fact, one second. Right, I'll introduce you. <laughs> To Peter, the long-suffering food processor. Pop that in there. Chuck them all in there. Waste of bran flakes. There we go, a few more there. A few of those. Pretty good, pretty good. Okay, once you've got your finely crumbed bran flakes, you need to put them in your bag. One pile of bran flakes in one bag. Okay, then you need to add some water, but just nice warm water. And you kind of want to make just a kind of a slurry, a bran flake slurry. There, disgusting. There we go, that's pretty good. <laughs> Something really disconcerting about that. Okay, then get a, as much air out of it as you can and seal it up like so. Very good. Now, we're going to leave this for maybe an hour to kind of mush up and hopefully all of those bran flakes will sort of disintegrate into the water. And I'm actually going to leave it sitting on the magnet. Oh, <laughs> go away spoon. <laughs> so there's my magnet there. I'm going to put the bag of crushed up bran flakes on top, see if it'll start the process, and then leave it, come back to it in about an hour's time. Let's have a look, <laughs> see if it's worked. So the magnet is still tucked away underneath here and the idea is that if there is magnetic iron in here it should be slowly drawn through the mixture towards the uh, the magnet don't expect too much <laughs> okay it, it won't be dramatic if it has happened at all so let's grab all of that get the magnet tucked away underneath there and lift the whole thing up Ooh. okay we just don't want to lose it Otherwise it will be disastrous. So, now, if this has worked, underneath this magnet there should be a tiny smudge of the tiny, tiny metallic iron filings that they chuck into the cereal. So, let's have a look. Okay, so see that there? You see that little smudge of brown there? It's right there, and you can move it around because it'll follow the magnet. That is tiny, tiny iron filings. I think that is absolutely amazing. It's the stuff that's lurking in your food and you don't even know it's there. So when I was looking at the back of the cereal packet and thinking, iron? Do they chuck iron filings in my cereal? It's actually true. That one's for you. All right, thank you very much for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you can and hopefully I'll see you again soon.